contour plot can be added to a real-time display as a layer. The contour plot is great to visualize distribution of, for example, temperature, groundwater and air quality. Let's go ahead and create a new real-time display. We open up the contour menu. First we select our variables. In this case we are going to select hydrogen sulfide. We have here five stations which we are going to add. We can see the latest values here in the table and now we select the first station. We click add and we click on the map where we want to locate it. Now we do the same for the other stations. So now we have our contour plot ready, but we can do some modifications. The opacity is how much is visible of the background picture. If you select one, then we only see the contour plot. And if you select zero, we don't see any contour plot. Default is 0 0.5. The default scale is auto scale, but we can also set minimum and maximum. and also the increment between steps. I'm going to set this back to auto scale. Then you can also choose the colors. We have the color for the lower limit, the upper limit and the middle. The show markers option is to display the markers and where they're located. You can also hover over them and click to see the latest values. If you remove it, the markers will be removed. The contour plot can be used with any other option in real-time display, for example, data groups, graphs, numerical indicators, and compass, for example. Finally, let's take a look at what we have just created. We go to real-time display, and here is our newly created RTD with the contour overlay.